the form for a fit desk for my N95 mask. Now we're going to put on our mask. You begin by putting the mask against your face. You pull the top strap high around your neck and on high in your head, and the bottom strap low under your ears. And then you're going to take two fingers with each hand and push from the center around your nose, working out. The mask should be low on your nose to make sure you have a tight seal. Okay, we've got the fit testing hood on Dr. O'Neill, and now we're going to test to see if she can detect the testing material. how we test for the ability to detect the Bittrex solution. Well, the uh, initial test amount is placed back into the hood. Now you, you'll have your test subject do deep breathing for 60 seconds, deep and regular. Again, every 30 seconds, half of the initial number of squeezes that were necessary for the sensitivity testing are put back into the hood. The next step is to nod your head up and down for 60 seconds. Once again, you're going to put the test solution back in, half the amount initially required for sensitivity testing every 30 seconds. Following this, the subject should turn the head from side to side. Again for 60 seconds, breathing normally, and at any time that she detects the taste of the test solution, you will know that this mask is no good. Next step is, is to bend to down and touch your toes. Good. And then to jog in place. Can you taste the solution? Nope. If the subject has not tasted it at all, then their mask is a good fit. You can then take this off and take off your mask appropriately without touching the mask. You touch the lower strap first, you pull it down over your face and you hold it down, and then you remove the upper strap and take it off. This is the safe way to remove your respirator mask.